Texas Ramps is a group of volunteers that build wheelchair ramps for folks here in Texas. And these are people that are financially unable to afford a ramp in their home. And Richard, first of all, bless you for what you're doing on this uh, project. It's it's really amazing. I was just looking at some of the pictures here with you of uh, the ramps that you're building. Tell us about this initiative. And first, I want to hear how you got involved with Texas Ramps. So welcome back to the consumer team. I was volunteered by the deacon in our church. He told me that we had a team we we're putting together and I was in charge of it. So he, this is where you need to show you were up. drafted into service. I was, okay. you, you know how you volunteer in church a little bit and all of a sudden you're in charge of a lot of things. That's, yeah. that's how it, but I really enjoyed it. I, Texas Ramps Project is something that started back in 2006. It's a 501c3. Year to date, they have built over 22,000 ramps for people in the state of Texas. That's over 100 miles of ramps they've built it from. If you, <laughs> that's if you, amazing. If, if 100 you, miles of ramps. If you go from here to Waco, if you put that in plywood, we've done it over, the, over the last 15 years in the state of Texas. And and so uh, you've got a website. I want to mention it, TexasRamps.org, TexasRamps.org. The demand out there is very strong. People. Absolutely need ramps and these are for people that can't afford to get them put Absolutely. in if you yeah. if you've if income. you've got the wherewithal you know i mean you'll send plans to people if they want to do their own but but the, you need people you need help don't you you need you need like strong bodies and you need some dollars I too need, i need strong bodies and strong dollars to help us build ramps in the state of texas how much does it cost to build a ramp it's doubled in the last six months with no COVID. With COVID, it doubled. It went back down to normal, and it's back up to doubling. So, what is it for your normal everyday ramp for somebody? I did a twenty-six foot ramp last week, and it was eleven hundred dollars for just twenty-six feet, and that is a. Short That's ramp. just the parts then, That's or just, just the, the materials. That's just the materials. Wow! And what's nice about Texas Ramps? It's a five hundred one C three. They have audited financial statements. That's about ninety-three percent of the money goes for materials. I don't get paid anything. I don't buy my tools. Actually, Hilti Tools has donated a bunch of tools to us. Well, let me tell you, ninety-three. If you're if you're a nonprofit and you're taking ninety-three cents out of every dollar that you get and delivering it to the people in need, that's that's a good that's a good number. Yes. I mean, yeah. you know, you, there's a, there's nonprofits out there with big logos and TV campaigns that have twenty percent you know, marketing budgets. So, right. yeah. yeah. No, this is all volunteers. I, we had a statewide meeting in, in Austin a couple of weeks ago. It was all gray haired people in the room. Apparently <laughs> once you retire or once you're done working, you go work for free for somebody else. And that's what we enjoy doing. So it's a fun thing. It's an all volunteer project. We always have plenty of time and plenty of materials and plenty of tools. If you want to come volunteer, I'll hand you a drill and I'll, I'll show you where to point it and we can build a ramp together. Now, the website, TexasRamps.org, is there a place to volunteer? Is there a place to give? Is that yeah. all? Pre yeah. there, there's a red button at the top for donate. If you happen to mention Parker County, it goes money goes to my community. You know, on average, we need about twenty five dollars to $30,000 a year in Parker County alone. Tarrant County, Dallas County, they are huge. There's six to eight teams to build every weekend in Tarrant County and Dallas County. So wherever anybody is in the Metroplex, there's going to be a Texas Ramps team near them that, that, need, that need help. Absolutely. And you can volunteer as well. Or if you have a civic organization or, or a Young Men's Service League or something like that, looking for volunteer work, you can go online and ask to be set up with a team captain and they will teach you how to do it. Well, it's keeping you out of trouble on the weekends. It does. But it only takes me three or four hours. So I might find other things to do to get me in trouble. We, we need to find some more ramps for Richard to build. Yes. That's the deal. We need the demand to be so great he can't he can't meet it yes. so well this is great richard thank you uh, richard ream texasramps.org texasramps.org and uh, richard of course from skin deep laser md but uh, just really blessing folks with this uh, nonprofit and all the volunteer work he does hey can you help out can you can you lend a muscle <laughs> next weekend can you give some money this is a, a great nonprofit. As Richard said, 93 cents out of every dollar going to the people that need help. And that's pretty extraordinary when it comes to a nonprofit uh, spending track record. TexasRamps.org for more information. TexasRamps.org.